Hi guys, Magic from Magic Apps UK here. Um, today I'm going to jailbreak an iPhone on 4.3.1 iOS, which is the latest iOS for your iDevice, iPod, iPad or your iPhone. Um, this is an iPhone 3GS, but it will work on iPhone 4s, iPads, uh, Apple TVs, it will work on everything. This is the new Tether jailbreak, um, so you don't have to restart all your, your uh, uh, restart your device every time. Um, first of all, let me just show you the operating system that this is on, and just to show you, that is on 4.3.1, as you can see there. So the first things you're going to need to do is you're going to need to go and download um, Red Snow um, 0.9.6 RC9. That's the new version of Red Snow. If you just search that in your browser, you will find plenty of websites where you can download that from. As you can see, I'm going to download that there. That's the Red Snow. And also download your IS, uh, IPSW file, which is 4.3.1. This you need to download in an Apple browser, so Safari, Firefox, or something like that, so it downloads as an IPSW file. Otherwise, it would download as zip files and RAR files, as I've found out today. Um, if you go to this website here, tipsneeded.com, um, and down there you will find a list of all the ISPW files you can download for the iPhone 3s, 4s, iPads. Pick the one that, that um, is relevant to your vice, device and download that as well. Um, I've downloaded both of them already and they're saved into a file on my desktop. Just one second download and I'll show you. file there on my desktop. You can see the IPSW file, you can see Red Snow. Um, I've also downloaded Snow Breeze because that will jailbreak as well with 4.3.1. Um, so basically unzip the file, Red Snow, and open and run the program. Um, and then you're gonna need to search for the ISPW file that you've just downloaded. So hit browse when you open Red Snow. And then search your device. Um, search your ISPW file, sorry, not your device. So find where you've downloaded it onto your desktop, jailbreak, and there the IPSW file. And select that file. And then Red Snow will start to this is a new model of iPhone, yeah it doesn't matter, that's just a warning message, just click yes if you want to continue and then the ISPW file is successfully identified, hit next and it will prepare to jailbreak the data of the ISPW file you're then going to need to put your device into the DUF mode um, this is asking you what you want to install onto the device, you want to install Cydia um, so that's all you want to do at the moment is just install Cydia and jailbreak the device basically. So select next. Um, please make sure your device is off and plugged into your computer. So now we're going to plug it into the computer and we're going to put the device into DUF mode. So hold down the uh, power button for three seconds, hold the power button and the home button for a further 10 seconds. Then release the power button on top of the phone, continue to hold the home button and your device will go into DUF mode and Red Snow on the computer will recognise it. There we go. So it's now processing the device and exploiting with line range so that will jailbreak the device and put it into um, put Cydia on your desktop and it will jailbreak the device. Then you may have to kick it out of a boot on the first time. As you can see, if you look at the phone, it's uh, jailbreaking, right, jailbreaking as it runs now. So we let that run. Um, and uh, it will take a couple of minutes to see that the jailbreak runs. still running. It's just running through the processes on the uh, the phone there, and it will tell you on the computer when it's finished. So it runs. The jailbreak will will restart your device at the end of it all, and your device will come back onto there. Computer will say it's finished. Um, if you slide to unlock the device, 
it's got everything on there and somewhere on the desktop there you will see Cydia the device is now jailbroken and, and basically you're going to need to run Cydia update Cydia, install your sources and start installing the programs that you want so that's how to jailbreak a device on 3. Uh, sorry, 4.3.1 um, enjoy guys once your device is jailbroken guys if you look at some of my other videos on the channel my iPhone helper you will see there's lots of videos there showing you what sources to add um, to Cydia how to get the free apps on on through Cydia um, also you'll see the the best things to add to your to, jail, to your jailbroken device to get better more icons on your desktop like this one the 5x5 five five there um, you can get different themes and things on your your iPhone as you can see it's another layout there you can get animated screen savers um, and info on your lock screen so look at my other videos guys and you'll see plenty of things you can do now you've jailbroken your device thanks guys